Hey everyone, welcome to this new Rodini quick tip video. In this one, I'm going to show you how to get the rubber toy textures to use on your simulations and everything. So, without further ado, let's go. So, first, you create your geo and uh, you wait. Come on. Okay, so you create your rubber toy test geometry, and uh, you see the rubber toy has some colors. But it's uh, it's not the CD attribute, okay? It's just uh, a material. So you, you to get the textures you want, just right click on your rubber toy, go to type properties, okay? And go to the second to last tab right here, extra files, and uh, you see it has three images. Uh, choose the toy res and click save as file, okay? Then you choose the directory you want to save it. And after you save it, you just uh, disable add shader right here, and um, you create this attribute from map right here, okay? And then in texture map, you choose the toy low res, okay? The attribute from map will get these textures and export as the CD attribute, okay? So, you can see, if I create this scatter, directly from the test geometry rubber toy even with the add shader enabled you can see let's increase the disable the relax iterations and increase the total count like that you can see it doesn't have any color in the points okay and uh, if I get this scatter from the attribute from map you see it gets the point attribute CD, okay? So it's uh, amazing to make your simulations and uh, anything you want to do with the rubber toy textures, okay? So thank you, hope you like this video and uh, doesn't forget to subscribe on the channel, activate notifications, it helps a lot to grow the channel and helps to you receive more of my videos. So thank you very much, see you!